All right, I'm not sure if any of you have ever gotten this error come up when you're exporting video out of Final Cut, um, but I'm gonna bring it up here because I just got this error and I want you guys to see it and how you remedy it. I think that's the right word. Remedy, fix it, make sure that it doesn't just screw you up because when it happens, you're like, what? I just, it's all there, I, it looks great. So, I've got this clip right here and I'm working on it and, you know, I can play it, as you can see, I'm gonna turn the volume down. I, I can play it here, right, it's, play, it's playing just fine. It's going through my clip. This is actually a video I did, right? Going to this clip here, all is good. Cool, I'm gonna go up here Go to my export, right? I'm gonna say I wanna export this and bring it up to here. Where do you, oh yeah, right. You get this, so this this is the this is the error, right? You go, all right, I'm gonna export this. And it says, the item cannot be shared while it's still reference media on the camera. And I'm like, what are you talk? What are you talking about? I hit the import button. I haven't changed any settings. Nothing's happened. So what happens is, Somewhere during the import phase, uh, the import didn't get a chance to complete. So you turned off Final Cut too early, or Final Cut crashed on you, or you ran out of battery power, or something. And what happens is basically the thumbnail uh, generated and came down enough for you to actually edit on, but that was all. I'm gonna show you how to fix this. This is quick. So I got this error. And if you look here on the computer, and if I clip, 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 if I click on one of these, let's say one of these ones. Now the bonus is I only have these ones up here. Okay, now, so I'm gonna go to this one. And if you look up at the top here, I'm gonna move this over. If you move in the top, this is lovely. It's, you know, it's playable, it's great. It does everything I needed to do. Nothing here. If I come to this one, you will see a little tiny camera in the corner. And it actually says, I'm going to just, this media for this clip is still on the camera. To begin importing, select re-import from camera archive from the file menu. Oh, see so what you're telling me is that if I just read the screen, it's going to tell me how to fix this. You have no idea how many times this just, I was like, you and you and me you and me yeah we're gonna we have an issue now because a lot of times you're just like which clip is it so what you're doing is you're looking you're just gonna go through all your your clips and look for one that has that little camera on it because that's the one that's that's not playing nice so once you get it there you highlight it right you go up to your file and you say import re-import from camera archive and what happens is it says are you sure and I'm like yeah so make sure that your camera card or whatever is re-imported and if you look now you actually see that import phase happening so what happens is it didn't get a chance to complete so it wasn't there but it's coming it's coming in so now I'll fast forward this for you guys so now it's done it's good. So that's gone. Both my clips look good. So now when I come up to my share and I say, let's do this, pop it out. It says, yeah, where do you want to put it? We're good. Next. Right? And I can put it wherever I want. At that point, out she goes. We're golden. Thumbs up. Fixed. Hope that helps you out because I know when I had that error happen to me the first few times, I was just dumbfounded. I didn't know where to look to get that fixed. So it's a nice, easy thing to remedy if you know where to look. All right, guys. Hey, if you like these, like, comment, share, subscribe, because I know you do. I know you like them. I like doing them for you. I like hanging out with you. I like it that you can use the problems that I go through to make it so it's easier for you. All right, guys. We'll talk to you later. Have a good one.